Hello all you BBFers. Just want to take a couple of minutes to give you a channel update. Um, I had several people sending me messages and such and instead of continually getting those and responding I'm going to put this up here. Um, everything's fine. Uh, the uh, messages have been a little slow the last three weeks and yes partially because of my health <clears throat> and uh, uh, I've, I'm just coming off of a second round of uh, prednisone uh, because of uh, my COPD issues and everything but I'm not complaining I've really uh, uh, there were a couple of two or three painful days I was dealing with pleurisy and that's no fun <laughs> but um, it wasn't due to infection so that means I didn't have to go on antibiotics or anything like that and uh, I think I'm out of the woods and um, we also it was the holidays and uh, on the days I wasn't sitting around in pain we uh, made some uh, extra visits um, and when you visit people who are, you've seen on our videos that we have uploaded this past month brother Dwayne brother Mark they make me totally forget about my problems God bless them and we spent uh, time with them uh, when uh, actually Dwayne and his son-in-law Charles came up from Parkersburg West Virginia to be with us it was a wonderful time and just so thankful to get his testimony on video it's blessed hundreds of people already then uh, brother Mark and uh, he, we videotaped him in the hospital I asked him if he wanted to because that, you know that's what he lives for and brother Mark is living to tell people about Jesus and he's been handing out chick tracks in the hospital now he's in a nursing home just pray for those fellas and pray for me and I honestly I want to be uh, healthy I want to be able to do the Lord's work that's it I don't pray for the health I don't even ask uh, to be able to go hiking again like I used to go camping <clears throat> uh, my uh, um, son uh, by marriage Charlie is going to be helping me get my uh, treadmill back up and running I won't be running on it, it'll be running, <laughs> but I just want to be active and all that. So I, I don't want folks to think anything r terribly wrong, uh, wrong has been going on. It's not, it, we had a wonderful holiday with um, some of our family, um, but at the same time there just seemed like so many people, an uncle that had to have a brain tumor removed, didn't know he had it, holidays came along and suddenly he's and he's unsaved. We've been praying for him. And um, a couple of folks that I grew up with um, battling cancer and uh, didn't, I didn't even know it was as bad as it was until recently. And so, anyway, I don't want to go belabor the point, <clears throat> but I want you to know, Lord willing, I'm out of the woods on this, and some of these other distractions like the holidays um, are over and uh, we hope to get back on the ball and um, be in, uh, uploading the Genesis studies uh, once a week at least but we really want to do two or three a week and um, special videos is, uh, along with our regular <clears throat> um, Sunday and Wednesday Bible studies we record locally and upload so that's that's all I just wanted you to know that so I don't keep getting in emails and and things from well-meaning people but in order for me to stay busy doing what I need to do I can't be answering email and things all the time and phone calls and <clears throat> and all that sort of thing so I thank you I thank you for your prayers and concern and um, I don't want to ever sound like I take that for granted I certainly don't but I also uh, just wanted to give this little uh, update so that I can stay busy and over the next uh, two or three weeks we hope to be loading you up. We also got a lot of hymns we still want to upload that we've recorded. And uh, we're always trying to learn more songs, but 
Uh, if there's a song you want to hear and you haven't seen us upload it, let us know. We'll try to learn that uh, between Jenny and Martha and the rest of the crew that uh, works on the music. Uh, they love learning new songs. So uh, thank you again. God bless you. May the year 2016 be a year where you and I both preach the gospel to more preacher, people. Uh, whether or not we see more people saved is between them and God. Don't get hung up on those kind of numbers. You worry about preaching the gospel. Let 2016 be the year you preach the gospel and give out gospel tracts to more people than you ever have before. That's it. Stay the course until Jesus comes. If the rapture takes place tomorrow, praise God. But if, if it takes place December 31st of this year, praise God. But by the time that comes around, we want to have done our best for the Lord Jesus, not to be saved, but because we are saved. Because it is our reasonable service, Romans 12, 1 and 2 says, to present our bodies as a living sacrifice, living for the Lord Jesus. God bless each one of you, and let's stay the course. Amen.